What is up guys? Uh, okay, cool. Nice start. Anyway, welcome to today's YouTube video. We're going to be going through a full day of eating because whether they're or not, and I actually looked at the last time I did a full day of eating and it was a while ago. So uh, yeah, that's today's video. We're going to be doing a full day of eating. We are going to be eating 3,200 calories. We are going to be having 230 grams of protein. We're going to have, be having between 40 and 60 grams of fat, and then the rest are going to be coming from carbohydrates. So I'm going to take you through that. Okay. And uh, and as always, we are going to be holding off our first meal uh, until around like 10, 30, 11. Um, I did wake up at half five this morning. We've been doing check-ins ever since. Um, and then, yeah, the reason, rationale, if you haven't watched my full day of eating before, is just simply, I just feel like a bag of dicks when I basically push in carbohydrates in the morning. So, or any food to be honest. So I, I don't, anyway, off. I need you. Oh god, you're stuck. So I'm actually, uh, so I'm actually gonna have my first minute of the day. Oh god, this camera's gonna fall. That's better. Um, I'm actually gonna have my first minute of the day, which is going to be simply a, a protein bar, um, and I'm also going to have some dextrose and EAA when I go to the gym. So this is my pre-workout meal, as it were. Again, I just don't want something too like filling and gassy because I just, I just get tanked when I uh, when I go to the gym. Now I'm not actually going to film uh, the footage because I've got a leg day. I normally do leg days on a Tuesday in the commercial gym. Um, to be honest taking a camera in like this is just a pain in the ass so what I'm going to do is actually film on my phone and just see whether the footage actually uh, looks okay for for YouTube. If it doesn't then uh, then yeah. But I don't really like filming on two devices, uh, it kind of just really takes you away from my session. You got to think that if you've ever filmed a session before, you know that it does take a little bit away from the session anyway, uh, because you got like set up the kind of tripod and whatever. Um, so yeah, um, I'm not going to do that. Basically, I'm not going to carry in two two sets of equipment. Um, I am actually logging on my phone, which is that's basically a tripod for my phone. I'm actually logging. Um, all of my training lifts um, that I'm basically doing, so every single lift that I'm going to be doing in the gym, I actually just film it. And then what I'm actually doing um, on the gram is actually created a different Instagram page called RT Training Log, um, which is easy. Um, but basically, it's just going to be like raw footage because, look, on my Instagram account, I'm super duper duper anal about what I actually post. Um, whereas is on that I just I'm just gonna post like raw footage of like how I'm going to be progressing my physique right what I do on a day-to-day -day basis and it it will look boring because it is boring but um, it's gonna get the job done in terms of, of building muscle so yeah if you want to follow that basically and have more of an insight into my training and how I lift on a day-to-day -day basis then then follow that account um, 
so yeah anyway i'm gonna get in the gym and hopefully uh, show you guys a little bit of footage and if there's no footage then you'll realize that the quality is disgusting disgusting i'm uh, i'm also gonna be gonna be having this because it's the goat so did i did i even go to the gym i just got two forks what are you doing you can tell I've been to the gym. Um, I'll put some training footage up here because, um, well, I tried to edit it, but it is insanely, what's the word? Shit quality. iPhones are not that great quality, so uh, so yeah, I'll just leave it to the side here somewhere. But yeah, pretty good session. I also did my check-in shots with AJ, which I'll also put here. Um, I'm feeling and looking pretty good considering I'm like 83 kilos. So pretty much exactly like 10 kilos up on uh, stage weight. Um, so yeah, will be will be quite interesting, uh, but yeah. Uh, for this meal, which is gonna be meal number two, we have um, rice, we have chicken, we have some mixed veg, which is insane at the minute. I've, I found this in, uh, in Morrison's at the minute. It's just like a mix, like almost like a naked coleslaw kind of thing, but that's, uh, that's very good. And I've also got some uh, five, uh, five kilos, five grams of, uh, of peanut butter, which is basically gonna aid in kind of digestion, basically, or not aid in digestion, but also slow down the kind of MPS spike. So that's the kind of role of fats in this in this meal now. A lot of people will tell you you don't need, or you should have fats very, very low post-workout, and in my opinion, you probably should. Um, but just due to my work life, um, this is the best way to get, or to structure out my day. Uh, and I thought about it a lot, trust me. Uh, so yeah, that's why I've got basically fats in this uh, in this post workout meal. But yeah, uh, not much to report. I'll probably see you in the next meal, unless I pick up the camera again. Hey, I decided to pick up the camera because uh, I had some some very cool um, a very cool delivery. So um, my aura ring died. Um, it died in like January or February. Anyway, um, I've emailed and emailed and emailed and emailed. Nothing's happened. Uh, so I actually reached out via Instagram, which is uh, obviously the port of call for everything nowadays. Reached out via Instagram, lo and behold, in within five days I've got a new aura ring. Uh, and I didn't have to pay anything, so I don't believe it is in warranty. However, I do believe it's a common fault um, that it just, yeah, it just, it just literally died. I couldn't do anything with it, couldn't even charge it. I could charge it, but then as soon as I took it off charge, it didn't charge, it wasn't charged, and it was on like, yeah. Anyway, I've got a new aura ring, um, which is kind of good news because uh, yeah, I, I do like I do like the tracking metrics that do come with aura. Um, so yeah, I, I've got the Gen three now, which is great. I only bought the Gen two. Ah. Okay, for my for my next meal, it's probably going to be a really weird one for you guys. However, look, it works, and I've got a call in about five minutes. So all it is 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 chicken. <laughs> And a bagel. Anything inside? No. Just a bagel. Hey, look who's here. Nice been out all day. Say hello to YouTube. Hi. Say hello to a full day of eating. Hello, full day of eating. Do you Can find four days of eating? <laughs> what? Tons of chicken? chicken sausages. Well, yeah, they're cooking. I'll show you the macros on screen. Uh, do you enjoy watching full days of eating that? No. Yeah, okay, well, you gonna watch this one? Of course! If you've, uh, if you've watched a full day of eating with us before, you'll know this is a very typical meal. We, we ha realistically have three meals in our arsenal, don't we, Nat? It's either fajitas, chick uh, chicken fajitas, burritos, or some sort of, like, mince, ragu, pasta, or chicken sausage. Ragu pasta. Uh, we're very boring, but I mean it works and it gets us big jacked and, and muscly. So yeah, I'll obviously put the macros on screen and uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna eat on camera because I, th I think it's weird. You just have to trust that I've eaten it. Oh, I'm also gonna have one slice of um, sourdough bread because I'm actually lacking a little bit of carbs. It's not really focusing, but you get the message. Sourdough bread. Um, so yeah, cool. And for the final meal of the day is going to be the frosted, frosted wheat, which is by far my favorite cereal. We also have, of course, the Oreo ghost protein, although I've just literally run out, so 
that's actually quite sad. Um, I'm actually going to have some peanut butter with it because um, I haven't really had that much fat for today, which is actually very much like me. I just favour carbs and proteins and don't really actively eat that much fat, so I have to actively try and add it in, of course. Um, so, yeah. Pretty much, uh, pretty much a full day of eating done. Appetite is fairly good, rate of gain is fairly good. Not much to kind of update you on in terms of my own situation. Um, so yeah, I'm going to end the, end the vlog here. Uh, hope you all. And uh, yeah, I'll speak to you in the next vlog.